Hi, my name is Zamar. I'm a student at the University of Toronto working on ReviewBot for UCOSP. So, so far in the semester, I did some easy fixes that was just uh, moving around some dependencies and adding a function to make sure BuildBot is actually installed before running it. Uh, the main project I've been working on is a credentials check tool. So the idea behind that is if you have some uh, embedded credentials in your source code or in a file in your repo, this will label them as issues. So I'm gonna demo what I have so far. Uh, so I set up a repo here and we have some files in here. So let's look at good code first. So here uh, we have our secret key and our AWS key. We're getting them from the environment, so that's fine. But if you look at bad code, we actually have the code embedded in, we actually have the secret key embedded into the source code. Uh, so we want this uh, to be labeled as an issue. We also have a private key in here, a private key file. Uh, we don't want this going to the repo, so this should also be labeled as an issue. And so if you look at the readme, so the file, files with extensions like pbk, pem, p12, or key, and files named something like IDRSA or ID ECDSA, IDRSA, these are by default going to be labeled as issues. Uh, but if there's other other files that you need uh, not, that you need not going to your repo, you can enter them here in your options on the review board site in in integrations. So here I added a a test extension as something that should not go in the repo. So we I have this file called custom test. So if this uh, is attached in a diff, this should be marked as an issue. And yeah. Uh, let's try to commit this. Get commit demo. And let's post this to the local server. So we got a link to our review. Uh, should open up in a few seconds. My local environment's a bit slow. There we go. Uh, I need to add somebody as I need. I need to add at least one person as reviewer. I'll just add myself, and then publish this. So once this is published, uh, ReviewBot will run, and we should see the issues. We expect to see four issues. There we go. So the credential check tool is running. We'll wait for that a bit. And yep, we got four issues. So let's see. So where we had our embedded AWS key, uh, review bot left an issue and the comment says potential security risk and in brackets it says what the risk is. So AWS key, similar for the AWS secret key. And then we had the custom extension that we didn't want, the test file, dot test. So uh, review ball left an issue here saying, including this file is a potential security risk. And same for the private key. And yep, this is what I have so far. Uh, something I wanna do expand on is, uh, so right now we, you can only add file extensions, uh, custom file extensions. So I want to expand it so that you can add your custom regular expression. So on top of AWS keys, you can catch other types of credentials, whatever your project is using. And yeah, there, there are a few concerns with that regarding performance. So I'm going to talk to one of the mentors about that. And once all the details about performance are hammered away, I'll be implementing that over the next few days. And yeah, that's it. Thank you.